Kia Rogers, and I'm a lighting designer. Um, I grew up in Wilmington and uh, various odd jobs and then started doing theater and fell in love with it and decided that I wanted to see what theater was like outside of Wilmington. And how long have you been in New York? Uh, five years. I am Brian Putnam. I am a composer and a playwright in, uh, currently in New York City. The first time I moved to Wilmington was in 95 to work with Opera House. I stayed until 2000, except I left for a year to do a national tour. And then I moved back in 2003 and left in 2005. Um, so, I don't know, six years total, I guess. I own a live webcasting company. We do live productions as well for live events and theater and anything you need. And I do sound and all that good stuff. We play music. I have fun. I lived in Wilmington for about wow, six years or more. I'm not exactly sure. It all ran together. <laughs> and um. How long have you been in New York? I've been in New York uh, for about almost 15 years. Hi, my name is James Sardone. I used to live in Wilmington, North Carolina. I now live in New York City. I was there uh, probably about 10 years. I miss my friends. What I miss the most about Wilmington is my friends. My friends, I love you, I love them all. They're the best people, they helped me out, they were there for me, they're family to me. I miss being able to walk out my door and walk down to the river and or drive 10 minutes to the beach. Here, yeah, there's a huge river right, right down the street, but it's not quite as scenic. Uh, the beach, of course. And I miss the relaxed atmosphere, the river, the beach. Uh, I miss uh, the laid back lifestyle. Um, I miss the sort of uh, small town aspect of it. And the weather. <laughs> I miss the weather. I don't miss driving. Uh, the thing I love the most about New York is I'm able to do my projects and do what I want to do. I get to work for myself and I, I, do, I get to make things happen. People, you know, there are people who make things happen and people who watch things happen and I make them happen. Uh, uh, I love the most about New York is the amount of cultures that you can get here, the different kinds of food. There's all kinds of food. You can get anything you want, anytime, of day or night. Anything I've ever had, any place I've ever lived, I can find in proximity to the city. The beach, the gorgeous like North Carolina type beaches are only 45 minutes away along Long Island. Um, if I want an apple, I have to walk like, you know, one minute to get it. You know, it's very accessible. The guitar shops are great. Well, I love the public transportation. I love the fact that there is a thousand and one things to do from theater, social events, restaurants, parks, um, and just the, the craziness and the energy of the city. I mean, you're constantly going and fighting and searching and um, it's just a rapid heartbeat. The feeling I get when I'm at Thalian Hall, like I get that feeling here at the Public Theater, which keeps me coming back. <laughs> Wilmington's pretty darn cool. I mean, that's why people like, like myself go and visit and then suddenly move there. Um... Well, I like doing music in Wilmington better, if you can believe it or not, just because we had a bigger audience, it's more more attentive audience. Playing in a band in Wilmington is a lot easier because everyone is like part of your band. Mm -hmm. 